this is the third and final part of making a fiberglass mold for our door panel. We're going to do chop strand mat, working with three quarter ounce material. We're going to lay that down on our mold cert on our plug and wet it out, making sure that we don't have any air bubbles. Um, on this particular mold, the transition between the panel and the flange, that little step is going to be our most problematic area. So we have to be careful to chase out all those little air bubbles. When we lay our next piece, we want to overlap by a couple inches. Make sure that we keep our bottom here nice and tight. We don't want a lot of waste. But uh, go ahead and wet out the panel first there and then work your way down onto the flange. If you do it that way that'll avoid as many of those air bubbles as possible. So we're just going to work our way around the, the part. We're going to do the flange first. We'll cover the centerpiece and we're going to do that five times. That'll give us sufficient strength in the mold. We'll let the mold cure overnight. We'll pull the mold off the plug and we'll be able to make high quality uh, parts in our mold.